much news. Not enough 10 minutes. Yeah. Oof. Oh my goodness. Well, you know, I think it's time we go for a vacation. A what? Uh, a vacation. You see, it's where people don't look at news for 10 minutes. A vacation. All right. Off to it. I would like to know. My favorite thing to do on vacation is listen to silly songs with James. Well, good thing we're bringing back a fan favorite. Even better news, it's all on YouTube now. So if you guys want to go take a look at it, go to the YouTube page, check it out. All right. You guys know the song, you've heard it before. So sing along. Off to you. <laughs> Get your running shoes on and prepare for Jesus' way. We'll follow God in wherever we may go. Get your running shoes on and prepare for Jesus' way. We'll follow God in wherever we may go. For it's God's will we will do. For it's God's will we will do. Get some overalls on, it's time to do God's work. Listen close, he's got a plan for you. Get some overalls on, it's time to do God's work. Listen close, he's got a plan for you. For it's God's will we will do. For it's God's will we will do. River, mountain valley roads wherever we may go paths highways hallways always no matter where we are river mountains valley roads wherever we may go he is the almighty god faster river mountains valley roads wherever we may go paths highways hallways always no matter where we are river mountains valley roads wherever we may go is the almighty God. Even faster, river, mountains, valley, roads, wherever we may go. Paths, highways, always, always, no matter where we are. River, mountains, valley, roads, wherever we may go. He is the almighty God. His plan for us is better than we know. So get your running shoes, it's time to go. For it's God's will, we will do. Oh, hey. You guys caught me doing my weekly Bible reading. You know, one of my favorite things to do, apart from listening to silly songs with James, is actually reading the Bible. You see, you know, this might be a really old book, but there's so much good stuff in it that actually applies to us today. That is why it is so important that we, as young Christians, read the Bible. You know, apart from all the, the really big words and, and apart from, you know, all the weird stuff that might be in here. Uh, you know, it talks of Jesus' love, which is really important. Hear this from Matthew 18, uh, verse 12. If a man has a hundred sheep, but one of, them, uh, one of the sheep gets lost, he will leave the other 99 on the hill to, uh, and go look for the lost sheep. I tell you the truth. He is happier about the one sheep than about the 99 that were never lost. In the same way, your Father in Heaven does not want any of these little children to be lost. See, you might be wondering, oh hey, he's just talking about sheep. But no, he's talking about you. See, the man in the story is Jesus, right? And if one of us goes astray, he would leave 99 other people just to come and find you. See, that talks about his love, and it's so cool. And there are so many other stories about that in the Bible. So, here's what I want you guys to do this week. Find a verse, or maybe a story, in Matthew 
right? And I want you to read that as much as you can during the week, all right? And then, with your parents, I want you to come on this video and comment down below which one you liked the best. All right, guys. Let's open up in a word of prayer, shall we? <clears throat> Dear God, we just thank you so much for uh, all these kids and, and all the blessings that you've given them. Lord, we thank you so much that you love us, and we thank you so much that, you know, you loved us so much that you gave the Bible to us. Uh, Lord, it is your word. You know, it comes straight from you. So we just thank you so much for that. Um, yeah, Lord, I just pray that, you know, you would help us continue to read your Bible more uh, because we know how important that is. Lord, again, I just want to thank you for these kids, and I just pray that throughout this next week that, uh, you know, they would continue to uh, seek out your love and to continue to look for you. Uh, Lord, we just ask your help. Uh, you know, we just, uh, we ask for your help just to love people, you know, whether that's in our home or at school. All right, God, thank you so much. All right, guys, let's close it off. Amen. All right, you guys have a great week.